More breaking right now. He just took the stand, and you've seen the video. Officer Stephen Matakovich accused of being a man outside Heinz Field. And tonight we're hearing why this happened straight from him. Pittsburgh's Action News 4 reporter David Kaplan. David, what do you have to say today in court? Andrew, day three of this federal civil trial against Sergeant Stephen Matakovich just wrapped up about 20 to 25 minutes ago. This afternoon featured a very intense cross examination between Matakovich as well as federal prosecutor Cindy Chung. Now, the two charges against Matakovich in this civil case are deprivation of civil rights and obstruction of justice. During that cross examination, Matakovich claimed he felt more threatened by 19 year old Gabriel Dupree before he initially pushed him than he did during the physical altercation with him because of the way Dupree was standing and acting. Matakovich claims that was the reason that threatening look was the reason behind his use of force and why it was justified. Now, Cindy Chung also hammered Matakovich on his actions following the altercation when he went up to the security center of Heinz Field and reviewed video of the incident three to four times before writing his report and charges. In that criminal complaint, that original criminal complaint from November of 2015, Matakovich makes no mention, though, of having viewed the video of the incident, and he also checked no on the original criminal complaint where it asks if video exists. Matakovich says he never took that video into his possession that night, and that is the reason why he didn't mention it specifically on these charging documents. Now, the defense did file a motion after the government rested to have this case dismissed. However, the judge denied that. Most of the security guards who you saw in that video who were near Matakovich at the time of this incident, they testified on behalf of the government. They were the government's witnesses. They gave their account of what happened that night. Matakovich will continue his testimony tomorrow morning. Again, we just got out of court. We will have much, much more for you tonight at six. For now, we're live downtown. David Kaplan, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.